This is my $10 Harbor Freight fishing hack uh, used on the piers. This is nylon line rope, quarter inch, 100 feet, two clips, and a roll of electric tape. All together $10 at Harbor Freight. Great deal. I'm going to show you how this is going to help you fish on the piers. All right, first thing you're going to do is we're going to get the end of the rope. I'm going to take one of these clips, and I'm going to tie it onto the end here. At least probably about like four or five inches on the end. Cinch that down. And then once I have it cinched down, I'm essentially going to take the black tape and I'm going to wrap it around the knot I just made. It's going to make this nice and secure. It's going to prevent it from unraveling and hooking and getting caught or anything. It works for me. And why this is such a hack, if you fish like me on the piers, there's a lot of different things to do. Now what I like about this is I get two hooks now on each side of this 100 foot rope. So if I'm on the docks and I want to put this crab trap down, I'm just simply taking my hook, locking it up here, and now I'm ready to roll. If I see killies in the water, I do the same here with my killie trap. Lock and loaded. I start catching bait, I need some water. I just hook this right on my bucket. Now I'm dropping this off the end of the pier, filling it up and pulling it back in. If I want to go pop a crab net, I grab my crab trap. And I do the same thing. Just hook this line right on here. And now I'm crabbing. If I don't want to crab, I just want to drop and simply drop my umbrella net. Same thing. I pop a line on here. And since I have two of them, I can easily leave my umbrella net in the water on this 100-foot nylon rope. And then I can use it then to click something else up. So if I want to go fill a bucket while I'm still leaving the trap in the water, I have the ability to do that. And then when I'm done, I rinse it off and I keep it up here. This is my $10 fishing pier hack from Harbor Freight. Hope you enjoyed.